So we just finished up at Kirby Studios. Thank you guys again, that was so much fun. It's really hot, it's currently about noon, 12.43, and we're gonna head over to Lambeau Newport to check out the Senna. Viper. <laughs> So we're gonna go head over to Lambo Newport and uh, see if we can find the Senna. So this is what we came for. We were at the photo shoot and there were like so many things on Instagram and Facebook that this car was here. So I was like, we have to come down to Lambo Newport. It's a brand new center. Gibbs. Hey, you steal this car? Hey, I'm out of here. I'm out. Hey, give it back. Don't film him. To be completely honest, I I've seen some crazy cars in my life. I've driven some cool stuff. This Senna is probably one of the most unique cars I've ever seen. The mirrors actually connect up on the side of the car. I've never seen designs like that before. So I saw this car about a year and a half ago for prototyping and I was just like, I didn't really care for it. And then now, I'm actually a huge fan of it in person. Door handle? I wanna see. Oh, I know the door handle, dude. It's a technique. Right here. Open the door. Oh. A little bit easier than I thought. <laughs> Hey, you never know, they get it complicated. It's a Formula One team building a road car, but you don't have to overthink it. Well, I almost did. The seats are really comfortable. They look Probably one of the most comfortable crazy. racing seats I've ever sat in. I love the design, it looks insane. And the window on the side, what the heck? Yeah, because when you're driving at like 30 miles an hour, you feel like you're going 300 miles an hour. Oh, yeah. You see the hashes on the roads, you see like all the pavement and everything. So you can see like the line as you drive. Yeah, yeah wow. it adds to the visceralness just in your peripheral vision. Mm -hmm. But it actually like for cornering stuff, you see more, you know, of, of the, your corners. You're supposed to be able to see. You see, you see when the turn. car first came out, when you saw it on pictures, what did you think initially? Compared well, to what it is now in person. I didn't see it in pictures first. I saw it, I was at the factory oh, okay. at the winter ball and I was standing there when Bruno Senna drove it in. So I saw the car in what? person. What was your impression the first time? Uh, race car? Yeah. I mean, yeah, it sounded neat. I mean, the, the wing was probably the, the thing that I was like, is that road legal? Is that 
Is that real? It was a little excessive. And I thought first. maybe they were showing us like a GTR version or something like that. So yeah. to actually see that, and they said, no, this is the road version car. And then of course your phone starts blowing up because everybody had seen it on social media. But everybody was saying, oh, I don't know, what do you think? It looks weird, the color doesn't look. And I think it was just the wrong color under the wrong lighting and not having it up maybe on a stage where people could get a good view of it. Yeah. You know, you had like 100, 200 people swamp around, you're trying to see it, so. So the first presentation was kind of crowded. You couldn't really get a good envision for Correct, it. Correct, yeah. Okay. So I, I think it just, um, you know, I think it it's gonna take some time to see some different specs in different colors. Yeah. I, there's a lot of race liveries that are gonna be done. I've, uh, we've spec'd a lot of cars with guys that are doing like some vintage Formula One liveries and things from McLaren's history. Mm -hmm. So all in all, I think you'll see some really unique builds and the car will capture the hearts of people. I think you just need to see it in person. Is there any secret that we can know as far as how many will be delivered in California? I don't know, because yeah. I only know how many I'm getting. Oh, and you have like 5,000, right? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. There's 500 cars being built, and we're getting like 490 of them in Newport. Yeah, oh my so. god. Well, we'll be seeing a lot of these around, I guess. <laughs> yes, yeah. So, dude. So. So we're, we're at Lambo Newport. At least two, I think. And we got Gibbs here. And he said that there's a Koenigsegg back here, and he wasn't lying. Diamond dust. With diamond dust in it. And Koenigsegg Newport Beach. Officially, man. Gibbs' dealership that he owns and runs and operates is now Koenigsegg franchise. I work for Koenigsegg now. Now you're a Koenigsegg dealer. How you feel with two cameras? Do you feel nervous? No, I'm used to it. Don't say anything, nervous. Parker. Parker, don't say anything. <laughs> I just don't know where to look. So I'm like, right <laughs> just look straight ahead, bro. I'm just ahead. <laughs> Damn, this thing is sick, dude. What's up, brother? Can I take a? <laughs> I'm gonna send that to Pietro. <laughs> <laughs> don't post that one. No. All right. What exhaust is it? Ah, so? uh, for sure. We really gotta get back. We have so much work to go do right now. 